여기는 스탠드 오프. 시골 마을이에요. 두 시간 반 운전. 브리즈번에서. 숙소를 못 찾아서 이상한 데 왔어요. 민 언니는 길 물어보고 화장실에 갔습니다. 허, 이 얼마 만에 여행인가? 나 운전 못 해. 렛츠고! 나 먹을 숙소 도착. 캐리어 결고 놀러 오시 방으로 가볼까요? 어, 뭐야? 언니, 자기 날 위해 이걸 렌트한 거야? 하려고 이거 뭐라 하죠 언니? 뭐하는 거? 아까 번들 맛이에요. 붓기 빠진 거 아니야? 많이 마셔야 돼. 붓기 확실해. 붓기 확실해. 카페. 이거 계속 부글부글 끓고 있어요 언니. 음, 피어 페어 페어. 그다음 나는 C. 이거는 나중에. 이거 먹어볼까요? 페어 진저. 나 이거 다. 페어 앤 진저. 생강앤 배. 와, 존맛탱. 음, 맛있다. 에일 맥주 좋아하시는 분 이거 추천. 여기 막 뭐가 둥둥 떠다녀요. 주스 맛이야. 주스야. 응. 약간 제그 감기 걸릴 때 마시는 그런. 그래도 알코올이 2% 들어있네. 주스네. 주스 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 응. 주스대요. 주스대요. 응. 음. 언니 또 나는 라이트 진저 난 없어 라이트 진저 약간 
약간 약간 생 약간 생강. 음 이걸 먼저 마셨어야 됐구나. 맛 없어요? <웃음> 아니 단거 먹다가 이거 먹으니까. 써요. 근데 나쁘지 않아. 음. 그 다음에 언니 사이 맞아. 오 맛있다. 음. 이거 음. 나쁘지 않아. 음. Good choice. 나는 그러면은 언니랑 다른 건 인디아 인디아 페이레이. 인도의 아로마 향이 들어있대요. 몰라 나 예전에 마셨을 때그 맛이 어떤 걸로 기억하고. Cheers. 벌레 있다. 아씨 벌레 빠뜨렸어. 음, 맛있게 마셔. <웃음> 마셔볼래 언니? 다른 게 너무 맛있어. 이거 별로다. 네. 노추. 노추천? 그 빼놓은 거에다가 사이다 섞은 것 같아. 응. 이거 근데 시중에 비슷한 맛 많아. 그 전이 달달한 맥주. 그 이름이 생각이 안 나. 있어요 그. 그 써머. 어 써머스비. 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 비슷합니다. 저는 그리고 마지막으로 아이리시 레드 에일 아닌가? 맞아요. 맛이 없을 것 같아. 할수 없는 맥주 맛이야. 아, 땡큐. 와, 우리 안주도 나왔어요. 우와. 안주는 근데 칩스 어디 가? 칩스 어디? 아 이게 칩스인가? 응, 또띠아 칩. 칩스도 나온다고 했는데. 또띠아 칩스 앤 후무스. 팜킨 하무스. 팜킨 하무스. 먹어보겠습니다. 먹겠습니다. 아 이거 좀 실패. 인가봐요 언니. 베이지 색소 우유로 만든 치즈. 아. 나 계획대로. 니에요? I don't know. 빨고 그냥 왔지. 무작정 왔습니다. 
<laughs> All right, so um, we do. Ha I don't have a sparkling open, so we can't try that. Did you want to try any whites? What's on the other side? White, please. Yeah? yeah. Okay. Uh, so I'll go through the taste if you like. So the first, um, I say we have a sparkling open, so I can't taste that, uh, is our Moscato. Have you tried a Moscato before? It's uh, generally sweet very sweet. Yeah, yeah. Ours isn't actually all that sweet because we don't actually add a sweetener. Yeah. It's like difference to me is like one is uh, sickly sugary cordial versus freshly squeezed fruit juice. Yeah. Ours is freshly squeezed fruit okay. juice, all right? So that's a Moscato. Uh, then we have our Savion Blanc. Uh, we all know what the New Zealand ones taste like. Mm. They've got a bit of a bitterness and a sort of a passion fruit or a tart finish. Mm. Ours is quite crisp and light citrus, so like limes and lemons. Mm. Then we have Angie's White's My Wife Special Blend. Lovely un unwooded Chardonnay, a little bit of Savion Blanc, a little bit of Savion. Mm. Uh, and then we have our rosé we call Cerise. Uh, Pinot Noir variety of, of red. And the way in which you make a rosé the, the proper way is um, you basically sp uh, press the grape softer uh, and you're just getting the juice, mm -hmm. right? And then we rake the skins through to give it a little bit of pigment and a little bit of flavour from the skins for about half an hour. Oh, okay. That's it. Yeah. Right? Generally, commercially, they'll blend a white and a red so they get that colour. Mm. That's the way you should do it, the way I just described. Then we have the Bloody Good Red, which you've tried before. Yeah, it's favorite. a blend, Shiraz Cab Merlot. I literally have about four bottles or five bottles left. Okay. Uh, so we'll try that. Yeah. Uh, then our Merlot, quite different to a commercial one again. The commercial one to me is a little bit of pepper, a little bit of spice, then nothing. Mm -hmm. This one I brewed on the skin, so it's got a lot more flavour. Mm -hmm. Uh, so that's quite nice drinking wine. My current favourite, our Cab Sav. Beautiful, well balanced, very smooth. That's like liquid velvet, I call it. One that I enjoy the bottle more the than Cap the glass. Sav. The Cab Sav, yeah. lovely drinking wine. And as is the Shiraz, not big and bold and heavy. Very, very well balanced and smooth. Mm -hmm. uh, then we have our man's best friend, which is our port, uh, which is our fortified. Uh, uh, it's a 15 year old premium tawny that I use Irish whiskey and brandy. So it gives a real honey tone, very, very nice. Okay, cool. So what will we start with? You want to try the Moscato? Yes, please. Yeah. Those people said, oh. We called to make sure it was open and... Um, Did someone phone, answer? No, phone just went blank. Okay. There must be something on their phone. Mm. <laughs> it's a Moscato. Yeah. Help yourself to whatever you want Um, uh, so, yeah, that's how. So, you'd see the difference if you've mm. tasted the commercial stuff. You get that real sickly sugariness. Well, there's no sugar out of there. Mm. It's just like freshly squeezed grape juice. Ooh. No sugar? No sugar. Good for diet. Well, <laughs> they have sugar. It has sugar, but natural sugars. Yeah. Mm. So, not like processed sugar, yeah. which is the commercial stuff. Yeah. yeah. They actually add that sweetener to it. Mm. Uh, like a like cordial. You know, if you're mm. making a, a cordial, concentrate and you add water. Mm. That's what they're doing. Mm. They're adding the flavour. Mm. All right. So, you've got to drink what I pour because I have no way of disposing it of it under the COVID thing. All right. Mm -hmm. Can I have an extra glass of the water, please? Oh, Just pour in there because it refreshes both your palate and the glass. I will go back to I will go back to the glass. When you're going around tomorrow, I'll give you a map, okay? Make some bookings. It's going to be quite busy mm. all throughout the weekend, fully booked, oh, right? Wow. Everywhere, okay? So. Um, well, you mean like a commercial winery? Both. Oh. Um, a lot of wineries are just taking people that have booked. Oh. 
so if you've made it, well, yeah, no, sorry, can't help you. <laughs> Yeah. That's because of COVID. Yeah, it's the capacity. Yeah. yeah. So um, I just say wait 15 minutes. Yeah. <laughs> um, generally, we haven't so haven't had to turn anyone away mm. because that'd be disappointing. You come mm. all this way. You know. So the Savion Blanc. So we've got that lovely Christmas and the little citrus on the front. Yeah. Um, lady that was here before, she said it's the best wine I've, I've been here for a week. So it's absolutely the best wine I've tried in a week. Good seafood. Mm. 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 Okay, so here's a map. So listed along here is all the phones and whatever. Okay. I so mean, it'll be it'll be funny to ask you like which other wineries you would recommend. <laughs> <laughs> well, not necessarily. I mean, yeah. that, it depends on what your taste is. So um, I don't get to go to them a lot. Yeah. Right. So it's it's a little hard for me to um, to be subjective, if you like, because I haven't tried it. I know some of my mates' wines because I yeah. go out with them, you know. Mm. But I don't know. The guy up the road, I haven't tasted his wine for years, mm. so I don't know. Yeah, every and every year it is yeah, different, different, you know what I mean? Yeah. 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 All right, so that was our... Um, Sav Blanc. Sav Blanc. Angie's white, Chardonnay, Savion Blanc, Semillon. Now when we're talking about a blend, the title of the wine is telling you what you're about to drink, okay? So if we're saying it's a Chardonnay, Savion Blanc, Semillon, Proportionately, there's more Chardonnay than there is Sauvignon Blanc than yeah. there is Semillon. So the title will actually tell you what you're having. Yeah. Yeah. I usually drink uh, Chardonnay. So. But don't get fixated on, uh, I had a Chardonnay that I once liked, so I like Chardonnay. Mm. A variety of wine is like a piece of beef. Mm -hmm. yeah? I know the unique flavours of that particular variety, yeah. but it's like a piece of beef. I can cook it a thousand different ways. Mm. It's still beef, right? Mm -hmm. So we think that what because we buy in this in a lot of the bottle shop wines all taste the same by variety because they want them to because they want you to have that product recognition mm -hmm. so that you know that if you buy the chardonnay it will taste like that mm -hmm. trust me i can make that sweet mm -hmm. right it, it's simply still. about but it's still a chardonnay mm -hmm. okay so it's all about how it's made rather than the actual variety yeah so yeah don't restrict yourself because you had one once that that was nice mm -hmm. I, I or you had one that was bad mm -hmm. i had a you know something and i didn't like it well that's good these are boutique wines they should not taste like what you what you have in this in the uh, bottle shop yeah. different process now my view is if it tastes the same we failed right it should be it should be different it should Maybe. be more flavor yeah awesome. yeah now have a little And he bought 25 cartons of it a few weeks ago. So I've got some to make, but I just haven't got, had a chance to do it. Mm. So six bottles, it will sell out. If not today, definitely tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> so Shiraz Cab Merlot is that blend. Oh, uh, so it wasn't rosé. Yeah. Oh, sorry, I forgot the rosé. We'll go to that. This is the bloody good red. <laughs> uh, I don't have any rosé to try. I'll get some. I'll open ah. some for you. I'll, 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 right. I'll open some. <laughs> Uh, so this is the Bloody Good Red, Shiraz Cab Merlot, um, uh, and it's available at South Bank uh, in Brisbane, oh. at a Barbosa. South Bank? Yeah. I work there. Do you? Yeah. Whereabouts? Tech. Okay, well it's not far from there. 
thing with the tape is, uh, so it's um, near opposite, virtually opposite IMAX theatre there. Yeah. In that little Grey yeah, Street yeah, yeah, precinct. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It used to be called Greystone Bar. Yeah, so about halfway along that precinct. What's Goes the bar called? Barbosa. Barbosa, yeah, I know. Yeah. Oh, okay. I'll get you some red back. Have another sweet water. This is not the same. And, uh, try to say, hey. I'm going to ask you, I'm going to ask you, I'm going to ask you, <laughs> 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 uh, yeah, so I wasn't here when he came up, he stayed in my cabin, I'm obviously a mate of mine. And uh, I came up and said, what happened to, all, uh, to my daughter who was here? I said, what happened to all the wine the next weekend when I was here? I said, oh, Temple took it off. I said, how much did he take? So 25 cartons, are you kidding me? 25. So mate, what's your story? You said, oh, well, I knew you were getting low, so I just thought I'd stock up. Um, oh. Good on you. <laughs> so this is our rosé. So Pinot Noir mm. is the variety. And you notice it's got a little bit of pigment, mm. and that's what you do. You just rake the skin through the, uh, the juice and ferment it. You're in when it's up. Did you like that rosé? Yeah? No? You like stronger? I... It, it was citrusy, very citrusy. Yeah. yeah. Um, for me, I like the more smooth. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I don't know if it's because I had all these other wines before. Possibly. It's quite a different rosé because generally rosé, they'll, they'll generally do it with either, well commercially they'll blend a white and red, and generally Merlot and Chardonnay, mm. and they'll blend it that way. Um, or, you know, a lot of rosés they'll do it with the Shiraz, because uh, the skins are quite dark, so mm. you, and we call it just splashing the skins into the juice, yeah. and just to give it a little bit of pigment, but it, and it has, uh, and you can, you can make it sweeter, has a bit of a sweetness about yeah. it. Yeah, I mean, probably also because I'm not normally a rosé drinker. Yeah. yeah. Well, young lady that enjoys a red is rare. Me? It <laughs> is. I'm, I'm telling you. <laughs> I, only, I only used to drink red. Yeah. And really? um, some Chardonnay. Yeah. That's it. Well, yeah. you like a bigger flavour. Yeah. yeah. What's your heritage Japanese with, right? Korean. 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 So yeah, the Korean barbecue food, like it's of Asian spot, like Malay also, the spice mm. that you would have with traditional food, uh, it's, it's a lot stronger, the Korean, mm. than say the Japanese mm. uh, spice, because yeah. they're different spice, yeah. obviously. Um, well, it was Korean barbecue was where those girls went in Sunnybank Hills. Yeah. Yeah, well that was where they had the... Oh, uh, uh, yeah, um, just the Korean restaurant started at Market Square. Yeah. And I mean, I don't usually go to Korean restaurants because I just cook Korean yeah. at home, yeah. you know? So yeah. I'm lucky I don't go there. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, when I heard that they were there, like, you know, and then they have to close this because, you know, it's such a mess for them. Mm. Uh, just because they were there. And yeah. Some other friends, a friend of mine who were there at the same place, mm. he got tested positive apparently. Oh, really? They were in the same area. Yeah. Oh, really? Same restaurant. Same time. Oh, yeah. Really? So that was your fault? Yeah. 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 Yeah.
why would you have a problem with you know, transmission of disease in a nursing care facility where people are susceptible to that anyway? Yeah, yeah it's not very high, you're obviously not practicing hygiene very well, you know? Yeah. But in this particular one that the lady was tested positive, there was no transmission. So yeah. obviously their hygiene practices were quite yeah, high, yeah. That's good. Yeah. Lucky. Well, I mean, we travel yeah, reasonably extensively throughout Asia. Haven't been to Korea, haven't been to Japan. My, I was going to take my dad before he died to Korea, he fought in Korea, and uh, he wanted to go back and he said, you know, he just got sick and we couldn't do it. So it was a disappointment I couldn't take yeah. him, you know. Uh, but you have uh, to go. I have to go, yeah. yeah. You have to try Korean chicken. I tried, I love Korean chicken. Really? I absolutely love Korean barbecue. <laughs> <laughs> and I like but the, when you go there, don't have Korean barbecue. I mean, maybe once or something, but because there's so many other things that you can't have here. Yeah, yeah. So, I mean, Korean barbecue you can have it anywhere, and the yeah. meats are better quality, I think, in Australia. Yeah. The meat itself. Yeah, yeah. So, I think, you know, when you're have there, have something that you can't have here. Yeah. 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 Hey mate, it's gonna be a few years before we'll be able to travel as a team anyway. You gotta try the live octopus. Why? Yeah. One of my mates has got clocked in one of the Greek islands, a Greek island called Samos. And so we generally go over there, we haven't been over for, we generally go our winter there, summer. And so generally in July, end of July. And uh, the way they do their um, octopus is quite different. They kind of uh, cook it with um, acidity, vinegar, yeah, yeah, mm. vinegar and, and yeah, lemon. And beautiful. Mm. So next we have our Cabernet Sauvignon. Your favorite. Very, very smooth. This is my current favorite. Nice. Mm. Yeah. So it's really, and it comes out quite different. Mm -hmm. Yeah, as opposed to cooking it on a hot plate or something, you know. Mm. Mm. Isn't it? Mm. Spicy so, yeah, see, the flavour kind of builds. And it's very smooth. Mm. Yeah. yeah, and that's a balanced wine. A balanced wine is one that doesn't shock the front of your palate or yeah. sit heavy on your stomach or anything like that. A balanced wine, I say this one, I could, I enjoy the bottle more than the glass. Mm. The reason I say that is because it just gets better. Mm. And it's like liquid velvet. It's mm. just beautiful. Mm. It's Mm. If, if you like that, you know, as you would sip, because you actually sip and enjoy that, you, mm. you just, you know, and you enjoy the whole glass. Because I don't like wines where I just take the first sip and all I get is a punch of alcohol, you know, in my nose. Yeah, and or it's like, and then you go, or it sits so heavy yeah. on your stomach, you go, I need, I, I need, you need water. To yeah. Mm. No, no. So that's. Um, the, the, what we call the bitterness and the tannins come from the stems and the seeds in the wine um, and we find that out I don't use an acid to find out so as, as you can taste there's no bitterness and there's no acidity in any of those wines they're rested for two years on oak before they go in the bottle so all of that heavy uh, all the sediments and the micro sediments solidify to the barrel it's actually a mechanical form of fining where the, the oak reacts to this acidity or the micro sediments and solidifies it to the barrel so it extracts it. Yeah. Commercially, they actually add, a, add a, um, an acid which chemically extracts to it, breaks it down, but it leaves a residual, you know, which is acid. <laughs> um, so, um, and then I, well, the first finding I do with egg white, so I literally separate eggs over the top of the vat, heavier specific gravity to the wine, settles through the wine, and again, chemically attracts these micro sediments and takes it to the bottom of the vat. And that's what we're doing. So in the process of boutique manufacture of wine is taking flavour out, not adding it. So by taking some flavours out, your palate will pick up flavours that were so subtle that you, 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 because your palate gets shocked by that bitterness, it won't pick it up. So, so that's what we're trying to achieve. Shiraz. Shiraz. <laughs> Mm. 
이제 취한 거죠 언니. 어. 이제 취한 어, 거죠. 약간 혀가 마비된 느낌. <웃음> 이제 이제 테이스팅 불가능. <웃음> 다 쓰다. 내 네, 시작하자. 내내다 네, 세트다 네, 한다. 쓰다 게임. 다이 브러쉬. 안 드렁크 널레기. Really? Mm. White white. <laughs> she had the big um w e n t to the brewery. Oh, okay. She had the big one and I had a small one because I'm driving. <laughs> and then we went to another winery. And I had a tasting. She tried all of it. Yeah. I left the sweet it. ones out and she drank all of it. Mm. And then now, yeah. <laughs> you, you can't go anywhere else. So seriously, you would be close to being over. Yeah. yeah. It's okay. I'm driving two and a half hours. You can't. <laughs> not, not now. now. Not now. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm pretty good with the uh, alcohol, but you know, we're going back straight to the combination. Good. Chill and then have dinner. Where's yeah. Where, where do you recommend for dinner? Okay, so you're in town, so in Stanford Central, itself. Yeah. Okay. Um, um, I would go to one of the pubs. It's easy. You know, um, it's pub grub, you know, steak or whatever. Yeah. Um, uh, but again, you need to ring. If they do two settings, mm. you know, so six o'clock, I think, and eight o'clock, seven o'clock. Um, so ring up Omara's is one. I'll run on here. Local <laughs> 추천이라고. <laughs> 아저씨 여기 있다가 좀더 카메라 욕심 내시네. 이제 little Thai restaurant is not too bad. Not, not, not great, but it's not bad. And the glasses. 현진 추천 맛집. 타이 레스토랑? 아니야. 일어나. 아저씨 너무 귀엽다 근데. Steak. You get a steak at the pub. Cheaper, than, you know. So it's okay, you know. Um, but you, you, they're not actually listed on here. I thought they we were. We went to brewery to have lunch, and then they only had like the fast snacks. So all. So made. was that here or at um, the Brass Monkey Brewery? Oh okay. yeah. There's another brewery here. Um, oh, I tell you, something's really cool. So you don't have to not drink though. So. Um, there's a call in on the way through. It's called Blue Topaz Caravan Park, right? Their um, cafe is set up like um, a 50s diner, right? Right. So it's got rock and roll music going, all neon lights. Um, What's it called? Uh, Blue Topaz Caravan Park. I'll grab you a brochure. And uh, but it's all American type hamburgers and chili dogs and all that sort of crap. <laughs> Really, really good. Now, they're big meals, so get get a dish and oh, share it. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, so. uh, they're quite big. So <laughs> I'll grab you one of those stomach. things. <laughs> yeah. So blue tap. That was something yeah. different. Yeah. If you don't do it for dinner, do it for lunch tomorrow. But again, book in because you're mm. gonna. I think dinner is good. Still, yeah. <laughs> maybe something. It will be very big. They're open for dinner, right? Yeah. Yeah. We have to go. Cool. That we have to ring up. I'm pretty sure they do yeah. dinner because it's Thursday night, isn't it? Well, let's book now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a YouTuber. YouTuber. Beginner. I'm on me. I'm finding. We should sing a song then, man. Oh. <laughs> oh, is it?
Coca-Cola. <laughs> <laughs> You're Coca-Cola-ish, yeah? Mm. <laughs> okay, now port, as I say, fortified with Irish whiskey and brandy. Oh. And it's... Um, so very alcoholic too, 17% uh, alcohol volume. Right? Oh, be careful. I don't have to deal with you. I know, but... So you Reason why my name is Coco. Oh, really? Chocolate. <laughs> it tastes like um, caramel popcorn. I reckon it's like gets a very honey tone about it. Like mm. it's um, very smooth and mm. warms all the way. Yeah, it's good. It'll be good like in winter, like you know. Yeah, yeah it's, it's, it's what you have in a yeah. a little shot, you know. And you just sip it. But I could have it as a dessert because I'm not a dessert fan. Well, that's what you would have. It's yeah. called aperitif, so you have to have a little shot of it. And you sip it, so maybe you're having coffee or something, and then you, you have a sip and then have a bit of coffee, mm. you know. Or don't have coffee and just have port, one of the two. Mm. All right, uh, so we've got a couple of deals on. Now I can do a special for you. Uh, you can mix it up between you if you like. If you buy six bottles, I'll give you a free Shiraz or a free Savion Blanc, mm. okay? Uh, if you buy a dozen, I'll give you a free port. And again, you can mix it up if you like. All right, so there's some deals. I'll get the six. Yeah. I will get the six as well. Okay. <laughs> All right. So I'll give you. So what would you like a free bottle of? Um, now bear in mind, I haven't got a lot of bloody good red. So make sure you. The, I, I think I've only got six left. Yeah. Okay. Because those folks so before the you bought it. Three one. You said Shiraz or Savion Blanc. Okay. So red a Shiraz mm -hmm. or a Savion Blanc. What was your what favourite red? Don't say bloody good red. I can't give you. That. What about it? No, I like the capsule. You like the capsule? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. I'll do one of those for you. All right. Yeah. No, I can't because that's a um, $30 bottle. So I could uh, do different. either a Shiraz or a Savion Blanc or Shiraz. Shiraz, sure. Okay. All right. Come up when you're ready and we'll uh, mix them up. So these are your maps, okay? Thank you. So, and I've got a little book here for you as well. Thank you.